Marion asked me about the importance of distant friends and how Audrey would have coped uh, during the war when she was trying to communicate with her brilliant photojournalist Lee Miller. Lee Miller had started working for Vogue in 1940 and by 1944 she had war accreditation and she was reporting from France, from occupied France, telling Vogue's readers about the situation at the Normandy Field Hospital, which she went to photograph in August of 1944. And then she moved on to the siege of St. Malo. She'd actually gone to report on the peace, but it hadn't been, um, hadn't broken out yet. So she actually found herself in the middle of a war zone. And she communicated with Audrey by letter. And these letters are absolutely magical. They're so full of at raw emotion, telling Audrey all the details of what she was witnessing, what she was seeing. And when she went to Paris, she wrote Audrey a breathless six page letter telling her about how Paris was coping, how it had coped during the war, what the situation was at Vogue. And these amazing letters give a really rich picture of the day to day, hour by hour stories coming out of occupied Europe. So she communicated um, with Lee in the main by letter, but also by telegram. And she told Lee after the siege of St. Malo, peace landed on her desk. Good girl, great adventure, wonderful story. So that gives a sort of summing up of, of how thrilled she was to have this brilliant photojournalist who wrote like it is, um, it's almost impossible to believe how raw and beautiful her writing is. So that was one of the great success stories of Audrey's war. She also wrote to her friends and family, um, so writing was terribly important to her and she also would pick up the phone. She was a great, uh, great, great phone user. So again we can take from that communication. It is so important to communicate, especially with people who are isolated. My poor parents in Cheshire, I can't get to see them, but we've sent my mother a tablet in the hope that she'll learn to use it and so we can all drive her crazy by FaceTiming her on WhatsApp. So I think that Audrey in this day and age would be an avid user of a mobile phone or a tablet.